Hello. I'm doing mine on prisoners post traumatic stress and uh, using the self help app. <laughs> I can't stop looking at that. Epic camera, the way I am. Anyway, uh, it was a very good app. We explained a lot about trauma and stuff like that. It had two PDFs that were easy to read. It also uh, had a video, and it also had a sign language video, which was very interesting. Uh, I thought the sign language was a great uh, ad. And then it also had resources such as phone numbers and places to contact. You know, like Prisoner Health Lines, The Good Samaritan, to name a few. And overall, it was really easy to use. So if you barely had someone that could know how to operate and surf around, they could find this app pretty good, and it's free. And there's a lot of uh, different apps available in there. It was quite a plethora from regular post-traumatic to depression, anxiety, cutting, you know, well, self-mutilation, I think they called it. It had all kinds of stuff. So, really interesting. This I chose the prison one. I thought it was interesting. You know, we don't do enough for our boys after and uh, and ladies after we throw them away. We we just uh, lock them up and see you later. So again, mine was post traumatic stress for prisoners. Very good app. Very well laid out. And like, like I said, I was surprised by the sign language. Had two PDFs, uh, one sign language video, one regular video, voice, and all kinds of resources. Easy read in a leaflet. So it was well done. Thank you.